So I watched um, Parasite. Me too. What'd you think? I enjoyed. I thought it was so different. Oh my god, so original, so original, so like what the? F- that was great. I loved it. I loved it. I, it was a lot of reading at first. I mean, it's a lot of reading. Well, the lo- there was a lot of reading to set up everybody who they were. Yeah, but once you got the flow, you kind of figured. Yeah. Well, yeah. then it became what's like. I remember studying film in college. Like, like I remember my film professor. He had this crazy accent and used to be like, "Don't tell me. Show me." Right, it's called right. a movie. Right, Show right. Show me. Like, he used to make us make films with no words. Tell okay. the story with no dialogue, just visuals. Right. And I feel they did a great job of building tension. Right. And telling a story where you didn't really have to just like be reading Told. a lot. Yeah, right, right. You mm-hmm. know? No, I, I enjoyed it a lot. I watched it in two because I put it on really late last on, was it today's Tuesday? So Sunday night, at like 1 o'clock in the morning, I was like, I'm going to watch this movie. Yeah. And I got about 40 minutes in and I'm like, I'm like, I'm not watching this movie. So I, and I watched the rest last night. It was really good. Yeah, it was, <laughs> I was sitting there because I, 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 I watch foreign films occasionally, but for whatever reason, I was having a hard time at the beginning with this one, reading it and focusing on the visual. Well, and, be, and because you wanted, to, you wanted to see the world. Yeah. But, and they talk so fast. Because they were talking fast, and I'm, I like pause it and see if I can move the words up higher. T- I'm like, can I put the words on the top? Like right in the middle? Yeah. Right in between, between their faces. faces. <laughs> so I, I wonder, they should like, uh, I don't know if it's like, do like bubbles. Like, yeah, right? Splew, splew, splew. It'd be too much. Yeah, it'd be too much. much. You'd be like... Yeah, you'd be like... <laughs> <laughs> but I, I thought the same thing. I'm like, can you move that up a little bit? Because then at some point, the, whatever the, the words were on, the background was also white. Yeah, so I was like, like when she was forging that, that yes, document. Correct. I was like, why is it... But how fun was this, like, watching... Like, uh, We may give spoilers, so if you haven't watched I, Parasite do yet... Give, do you want to give spoilers? I guess we don't have to, but we're going to talk about the movie, I yeah, guess. Yeah, so we right won't now, spoil the if end. If you're looking to watch Parasite, I would forward just fast forward. Until like, you hear us not talk about it. We yeah. don't know how long we're going to talk about it for. <laughs> I'd say fast forward 10 minutes, but we don't know. Yeah, it could be 20. could be three minutes. could be three. Just, you know, yeah. every once in a while, hit play. If you, Parasite, and have to fucking move on. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but um, I love the way they built it was just it got so fun watching them build it family member by family member i know going into this house but what was great is the reveal to me by the second family member i'm like oh when the daughter came in when he brought the sister in when he the, brought the yeah sister, the sister in, i yeah. was like oh wait oh my god she's is this a plan or to just happen to fall out but it turned out to start being a plan and then i realized what the word parasite meant because it's like you know Basically, a parasite kills you from within, right? Yeah, yeah. So yeah, it's, it's like, like an infiltrate. Yeah, so they're infiltrating. So I'm like, I'm like, oh my god! It just started to click. The whole thing started to click right, like, like then. And I was like, oh, this is fucking brilliant. Yeah, it was so good that the acting was so great in it. Really good. Like it was like I'm I'm sitting there because I didn't see it, and I saw a lot of you know. Uh, schmoes on Facebook complaining that a foreign film won Best Picture. <laughs> what? Now I gotta go read. Yeah. Yeah, you dummy. Yeah. It's so what do you dumb. mean? It's a film by people. Yeah. It's right. who cares? Yeah, who exactly. cares? Like I, that's what you know what bothers me. Hollywood don't give. We don't give a fuck about Hollywood. But now all of a sudden you do. Like, what, do you care about the industry? And you don't give a fuck. But who cares? If you think Hollywood is a bunch of elites patting each other on the back, cool. Then this shouldn't bother you. Yeah, this shouldn't even affect you. You should be just going through your life, going, "What? Well, oh, okay, I don't watch Hollywood. I don't care about." Yeah, it Hollywood. should have. Yeah, it should affect you zero. Zero. Should affect you zero. But um, the cinematography was awesome. The way the guy, the that house they were shooting in was just beautiful architecture. Absolutely. And the way they it, like just how everything was like perfectly framed and mm-hmm. just worked right. Like the the way they framed everything, the lighting, and um, when that girl like took off her underwear right right. i was like what a brilliant little yeah yeah move to like yes it was just such a good yeah it was like a subtle way because like even to then you're like what is yeah what what is she doing they had they had a i did not like they had me guessing the whole time correct i didn't see anything Anything coming, coming nothing coming especially um once they were, I, I just, it was so great when they're all in the house and they're all infiltrated and they go away camping. Yes. And they're just like, ah, we're going to start. They're just living in a rich person's house, yes. drinking their booze. Like, they were like, we, one day we'll live here. Like, we'll live here now. We're living here now. Like, this, yeah. This is our house now. That's, so right when they went to camp, camping, I went to sleep. And then I woke up, yes, and then last night I put it on. So my very first scene was the older housewife. I mean, uh, 
housekeeper coming to the screen talking and all beat up when she was like, let me in. Oh, yeah, yeah. And I was like, that's when I came back to it. Right. So I came back to this. So I got to watch the whole setup. And then the whole yesterday was all that. The last part. Not the last great. part where they find. Which was great. The. Uh, which the, the basement. The bunker. Yeah. That's amazing. It was it's, awesome. It, yeah. I don't want to give away anything. Yeah. In case people watch it. But definitely watch Parasite. I think it's one of the best movies. It's. And if you want to. My. Can I give my take on this? Yeah. Yeah. If you want to know. Why a foreign film? You, yes, you can argue. The one guy I saw make an argument: they won best foreign film and then they won best overall film. I get that confusion of categories. Like, what well, these pictures weren't able to be in that category. Right, right. So I get, I understand that, but it's a small little detail in the bigger picture. If you want to know why Parasite beat out all those other American films, because all those other American films, aside from. Um, Once Upon a Time in Hollywood have been done. They're not original. They weren't original. Yeah. The Joker, we've seen that guy before. We gave right. another Joker an award. Joker is just we're done. All right? Yeah. Might have been a great movie, but it was done. Little Women, we read the book. We've seen these type of movies. It's not yeah. really, you're not breaking any ground with that. Um, what else? Uh, what was the other one? 1917? Great, visually beautiful. Yeah, that's the one I loved until I saw Parasite. Right, but then you think about it was a great story, but okay, is it so original? No, this was so original. That's my point. So amazing, and the way they vote in the Academy Awards, so it's like, like, so they get their nominations. Like, like people vote to get who who's ever going to be nominated. You just like put your right. numbers down. Yeah, so yeah. Like when you have like your ten films or whatever, you just number them. Like I think this one's first, this one's second, yeah, this one's yeah. third. So then they add up like, okay, this one. Uh, yeah. So like Parasite could be two on somebody's, one on somebody's. So right. whatever it's the highest in. Right, right. It gets it. It's yeah, not yeah. like the number of votes. Correct. Unless it hits 50, 50 um, number ones, it's automatically the best picture. Okay, I got you. Yeah, you know yeah, I mean? yeah. Right. If it gets 50 number ones. How many people vote? I forget the number. I heard a breakdown. It was a, it was on some guy was on Ron Bennington this week, like one of the, like the movie critics. Yeah, yeah. And he like broke it all down how the voting works. Okay. And stuff like that. And yeah, okay, we all know voting schmarmy and stuff. And and but when you watch the film, it's freaking amazing. And right. I've seen everything. Right, right. I've seen it. I was I was sitting there just like wowed the whole way. It was beautiful. Right, the acting was awesome. I mean, the way they show it, even in the beginning, the family searching for Wi-Fi and how important it is. Absolutely, and yeah, everything. 100%. I mean, the way the the blackmail of the sending the video with the yeah. phone, just like these right, right. great little nuances. Yes. You know, like things that you didn't realize were setting up the theme of that end of the movie, living where they live in the basement. The shit that yeah. they're going through. Remember the drunk guy peeing by their window all the time? Like those little things you don't realize that is playing in the dad's head yeah. the whole time. And then at that, towards the end, when all the things start to break down and, and the, the father's playing his life versus this motherfucker's life. Yeah. And you guys are acting like you had it rough today because you had to come home early from your camping trip. Like those things start to play. And you're like, now all those little things that he's been like those hurdles in their life start yeah. to add up to make yeah. him who he is. Yeah. And then the, when, he, when he was like, when they were dressed as Indians behind the bush, and he was like, "You're just you're getting paid for this. This is work." And yeah, was, yeah. He was like, "Absolutely." Uh, like that's when you saw him. Like, no, yeah. What? Exactly. You don't treat me. No, and that and the <laughs> smelling. He smelled yeah. that whole thing, and like he just his family just you know like what happened to their house with the floods and everything like that, and then like your family is like, "Hey, yeah, we make turn lemon into lemonade," and he's like, "Lemon into my fucking house is gone. I'm wearing someone else's clothes." Yeah. Like fucking in a, you know what I mean? Yeah. Like that's the stuff that started to play. And the beautiful thing is, it was so subtle. You didn't. Right. You know, you didn't. It know wasn't was, like him, like. Dun, 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 dun. like yeah. You no, know, yeah. You was, weren't seeing it until yeah, you saw it. Exactly. The first inkling. I mean, I didn't see what happened. Right. But the first inkling that I knew he was getting annoyed was behind the bushes. Right. You know, like you saw him hurt when he was laying there hearing yeah. that. Yeah. Yeah. Hearing about the smell. My in how funny, but the laughs, the dark comedy element. I know, yeah, like yeah. When he's going across the floor, and then the kid puts on the spotlight, and he's yeah. just stuck yeah, there. Yeah, yeah. Oh my god, it was like yeah. a perfect dark. Because yeah. I was sitting there watching, thinking they don't make dark comedies no more. Right, I can't think of the last dark comedy that like I a legit, rem- like a legit, like uh, what was that um one with uh, Jeremy Piven and was it um who else was in it um fuck in the nineties. Where they go to Vegas and then 
that dark comedy where like just keeps getting worse and worse for them and it killed a hooker. Um, I don't remember. It'll come to me by the end of the podcast, but oh my god, is that with Jay Moore? Not was Jay Moore in it? No. Let me fucking see if I can search it out real quick because it's gonna freaking kill me. But what else <laughs> did you like about? But what I, I mean, I just really my point of the whole thing is if you want to know why it stood out amongst all those other films, because of how it was shot, because of the, of the of the. Very bad things. Okay. Do you yeah, remember yeah. very bad yeah, things? Yeah, I think one time. Ah, that, yeah. I have to watch that again. So this movie was so different when you put it up against all those other movies and yes. well done, well acted. I mean, shot impeccably. Just the story was told amazingly and you put it up against other great movies. What's the thing that's going to bump it to the top is how original it was. So original. Every There was not one time where I thought this didn't deserve best picture. Yeah. Right. It was a it was it was a great a great movie and it's even a rewatchable movie because even though you know what happens now you can go back and kind of see some of those things. See some of the yeah. new things yeah. that that mm-hmm. were like tipping it off and everything. Right, right, right. But uh so I think that was as close to a spoil free um yeah. uh review of yeah, you're, you're, you're Parasite watching, and uh, we give it two thumbs up.